Hello, this is Emil from Less EMF. This short video is about the personal EMF alarm. This versatile meter will check for AC, electric, and magnetic fields from power lines, appliances, computers, and more, as well as checking for leakage from microwave ovens or other analog RF signals. It includes an alarm with adjustable threshold, so it will alert you when the preset level is exceeded. The personal EMF alarm is very easy to use. There are only two controls. On the front of the meter is a rotating knob which is used to select a field type. You can select only one type at a time. Set it to magnetic or electric or radio microwave. There are two ranges for magnetic. Start with the 0 to 100 range. The 0 to 3 range is useful only for very weak fields. The meter has a large display with needle gauge. Use the top scale when set to magnetic 0 to 100 or electric field. Use the middle scale when set to magnetic 0 to 3. Use the bottom scale for RF measurements. Notice that there is a red line beneath the numbers. At the low end, the line is dotted. The dotted area represents the acceptable level of exposure as determined by the manufacturer. So, for example, I have the knob set to magnetic 0 to 100. Looking at the top scale, the level reads about 4 milligauss. The units used are printed on the face of the meter. Milligauss for magnetic, volts per meter for electric field, and milliwatts per square centimeter for radio waves. Note, do not use this meter to measure digital RF signals. It will not be accurate. This meter is 3 axis for magnetic field measurements. That means that the meter looks in all directions simultaneously. You do not need to worry about whether the meter is pointed in the right direction. For electric fields and radio waves, the meter reads out the top of the meter. The alarm serves two functions. You can set it to alert you if the level of radiation exceeds a critical level, and once the level is exceeded, the intensity of the sound corresponds to the intensity of the radiation. The knob on the side of the meter adjusts the alarm threshold. It is best explained with an example. Let's use 10 milligauss. First, turn the black knob to magnetic 0 to 100. Bring a source of magnetic field towards the meter until the needle just reads 10 milligauss. Now, simply rotate the side knob until the sound just turns off, like so. As you can see, when the level exceeds the threshold, the alarm will sound again. When the level is below the threshold, the alarm does not sound. As the level of radiation increases, the sound intensity increases as well. The reaction time of this meter is very fast, so the sound feature can be used to very quickly sweep an area, determine hot spots with very little effort. The alarm works in all mode settings, electric, magnetic, and RF. The personal EMF alarm measures a variety of EMF types with a user-friendly interface. The sound feature works both as an alarm and intensity indicator. It is a great general purpose EMF meter. Order now.